I am in my living room. Um, the lighting is kind of weird, but there's really nowhere in my house that has good lighting today just because it's really, really like stormy outside and kind of dark and it's just a wax video. I figure it doesn't need to be like high resolution or anything. Um, I mean, how much could there possibly be to see? So just bear with me. I have two videos to do. I have a Teddy Bees haul and a Rainbow Melts haul. I'm going to do the Rainbow Melts one first um, and start out with that here. I have them both here in the same box, so I'm just going to take out um, my stuff from my Rainbow Melts haul. So I know Rainbow Melts isn't like widely loved um, in the wax community because of some turnaround time issues they've had in the past and just some general like... I don't know situations um but I will say I placed this order I don't know what day I placed it but from the day I placed my order to the day I received my order it was two days like I placed it and then two days later it was at my door so it was nice that's like the fastest turnaround time I've ever seen um with Raymond Melts I wanted mainly one thing so it's just like a small order I think it's only like six things and I got two samples so I'm gonna start out with the samples first um <laughs> which like very nice she gave me two samples these are both huge samples like very generous of her the first one is super fruity and this is like a little thank you bar I guess it just says thank you on it looks like this which is like really cute right um and this one is strawberry kiwi and lemon sugar I don't like this at all it smells weird <laughs> this is like a bad way to start off it's like kind it almost smells like a cleaner, just like a chemical, chemically fruity scent. It's like a fruit, but it's not like bright or juicy. I don't know. I, my oldest, my youngest daughter liked this because it was pink. So I'll probably just put it in her room one day. Um, but my oldest daughter, I let her smell that. And she was like, ooh, what is that? Did they just throw all the leftover waxes into one wax? And I was like, yeah, that is kind of what it smells like. It's just like a weird mishmash of fruits that I'm not like a huge fan of. I'm not a like huge like fruity person, but... If I do get a fruity scent, like, I want it to be, like, juicy and bright and, like, ultra fruity. That's, like, I don't know, <laughs> murky. Um, okay, so the next one I got, I know I love this one. This is Snow Clouds. And this one is Sweet Snow, which is vanilla ice cream, essentially, and White Clouds, which is, like, a laundry. So it's, like, a vanilla laundry scent. And it's, like, these super cute little French baguettes. There's two of them in the bag. I really like this. I've had it before. I've actually ordered it before. Um, her sweet snow, like that vanilla laundry or that vanilla ice cream scent is really nice. It's like a nice, just like vanilla extract type of scent. Really good. I love vanilla. I love laundry. I've melted that one before and it's relatively strong. I will say that Reba melts vanilla scents throw more strongly than other vanilla scents that I've experienced. I like want to move this so I can't see it in the camera. Sorry. I'm going to move it all the way here. Did I get that off? Okay, that's fine. Um, next, I ordered... So that was it for the samples. This is one I ordered. So this one is Red Nose, and this is Tart Cranberry and Glowing Ginger Ale. Rainbow Melts is doing um a... I don't know what day it is. Is it the 25th? I feel like everywhere is doing a restock on the 25th, but I know they're doing one relatively soon. And it's like a Black Friday sale and it's gonna be like her mini loaves for $5. It's like 20% off or something. But anyway, this one looks like this. It's really cute. It's like coming across more orange, but it's like a pinkish reddish. And this one is Tart Cranberry and Glowing Ginger Ale. I love this. This is like the perfect cranberry scent. I wish she would offer this in her mini loaves because I would order a couple more mini loaves of this. This is like such a nice sparkling cranberry type of scent and I feel like cranberry scents are really hit or miss for me some of them I like really really like and then others just come off as like flat or dull that one is like perfectly tart love it that was really good um okay I got this gingerbread man in the scent what is this called gingerbread bliss so this one's gingerbread brulee sugar cookie and butter brickle And this gingerbread man is actually super cute. So I'm not, look how shiny. I'm not a huge butter brickle fan, but I like this. I get mainly gingerbread and I'm glad that there's sugar cookie and butter, butter brickle to go with it. 
because even with those three scents mixed together, this ginger is very gingery. Like it's, it would be much too harsh if it wasn't mixed with other scents, that gingerbread brulee. Yeah, but it just smells like a, I don't get that like really like overly sweet, nutty kind of like caramelized praline butter brickle type of scent that's like really like buttery and sweet. I don't get that at all. It just smells like a molasses cookie or like a gingerbread cookie. It smells like Trader Joe's molasses cookies if you've ever had those. Those are like my favorite. Let me do it. My cat's getting ready to jump up here and ruin the delicate environment that I have created. <laughs> just kidding. I just have my camera or my phone set up on like this thing in front of me. So if she jumps over, I'm scared. It's going to knock it over. Okay. Um, the next one I have here is this tree and this is in the scent angel tree sorry i keep holding them like sideways and this one is balsam cedar and soft cashmere i figure you couldn't go wrong with those two scents i really love this one yeah is i smell mainly balsam and cedar maybe a little bit of cashmere in there as well really pretty i love these she's done these before penny lee down sorry my dog's walking around Anita. I just got her um, claws clipped. Jump up, jump up on the couch. I just got her claws clipped, um, but she still like makes so much noise when she moves around the house. So just ignore that. And the next three I got are snowflakes. So this one is Frosty Days. This one is Peppermint Candy Can and Sweater Weather. I love Rainbow Milk Sweater Weather. It smells just like the Bath and Body Works Sweater Weather. It's just pretty, like, white. This mainly just smells like sweater, we sweater weather to me. Maybe, a like, slightly more minty, but it's just so good. It's just a good, like, anywhere in your house. Like, bedroom, bathroom. Like, it's fresh and wintry and beautiful. Love it. Okay, and then... The scent that I mainly wanted to get is this one. It's Let It Snow. I got two of these. This is the last thing. And this one is Sweet Snow Taffy, Peppermint Swizzle Sticks, and Frosted White Cake. I have one of these left from last year, and I've been holding off, like, melting it until I could have a little more. Oh, I have, like, wax all over my lip gloss. Sorry. Um, this is so nice. It's really very heavy on the vanilla, like that sweet snow toffee and frosted white cake. It really just smells like the most decadent. It's not like a bakery vanilla. It's like just like a rich, like vanilla frosting almost. Or like a really nice, slightly leaning gourmand vanilla body care type of scent. And then I don't get a lot, there's peppermint swizzle sticks in this. I don't get a lot of peppermint. Like it's not like bam pepperminty. It just adds like a freshness to that vanilla without making it like minty minty. So good. Just sweet vanilla with like a, a light hit of mint that just really freshens it up. I love this scent. I think, I feel like you would have to just smell it, but I highly recommend it. Um, and that's it. That's all I got from Rainbow Mouths. It was just a really small order. I'm going to do my Teddy Bees pre-order next. So I will be right back with that. 